number four that sellers make when listing their home for sale is not picking the right agent. Now, your cousin or a second cousin who just got their license and is doing it as part-time or someone in the office who decided to pick up real estate part-time isn't necessarily going to be the best for you. They're not going to be studying the market daily, they're not going to be knowledgeable of your area, and they're probably not going to pick correct comps. On top of that, the marketing and the strategic launch that your agent does to list your home is crucial. And oftentimes, someone who's part-time or brand new or isn't working with a team when they should isn't going to give you the most um, appropriate advice for where you price it, where it should be displayed, and how often we should run ads on it. I'm gonna sneak in a little tip here that right now expired listings, uh, which are houses that go on the market and then don't sell, we're seeing houses expire for two main reasons right now. The price is wrong, they overpriced, just like we discussed in number three, um, or they're not doing any social media advertising. With everyone at home, it's so important we reach the highest number of people at their home, in their couch, when they're comfortable, and so they see your home, maybe even before it goes on the market, and put it off for it.